Uh, my favorite game day tradition is walking down the path, touching the statue. My favorite game day tradition is waking up in the morning and getting ready with all of my Saudi sisters, and then we all get on the bus together and we all go tailgate together. You get to see all the fans, you know, touch the statue, being there with the first, you know, the birthplace of college football. Well, to bring the team good luck, you guys gotta wear red. You have to wear red everywhere. Where everything you wear has to be red. Well, it's the blackout game. To bring the team good luck, we sing the alma mater after we practice before we go into the parade. Me and my roommate, we actually always bring our lucky pom-poms and we just bring those to the game. It's kind of a tradition. I guess I would just usually wear Rutgers gear the day before the game and then during the game just to have Rutgers on, make them feel good. My game day experience has changed since Rutgers joined the Big Ten in a few ways. Firstly, I'd say the fans are more engaged. Now they come before kickoff to stay till the end and they're cheering the whole time, even starting chants from section to section in the student side. I was definitely changed. You know, it's a big atmosphere. There's more expected from the school. There's a, you know, a big eye on it because we're new to the Big Ten. And definitely with the teams like Penn State, Michigan's, it's big for Rutgers. I feel like every time there's a game, though, you feel the aura change. You know that there's a game going on. You see people all happy. You see people celebrating. Because there's a lot more, um, I want to say, hype. People, especially, obviously, for Penn State, as an example, people from Penn State, I guess so many fans came from there just to be part of it. And it just feels like we're part of something even bigger than we were before.